guys welcome back for another video um bit of a continuation from the camp fun days one um finally got my order through from funko for a giant pop order and bitty pops and things like that that i've done um the first one that my partner just picked up on the way home from smith's actually is the uh the hatching raptor from jurassic park which is a really it's it, you need to see it in person actually it's a really really nice pop there's that one there. They only have two left as well, and I was starting got them in yesterday. So, obviously, a really popular one. Um, they are about nineteen pounds, the same as the the website. So, there's that one there. Summer convention. Don't really have any Jurassic Park ones, but this one and the uh, translucent orange one were were really nice. So, I'm just going to grab the ones that I've got from Funko, and they've put them in giant sorters. So. Never ever convinced again. I, I was probably bang on about it in videos, but I'm never really convinced with the uh, packaging from Funko Europe. It's always a miss, you'll get a few damaged ones probably. Um, I, I always think, unless they're major damage, I tend to just keep them. Uh, but I did have one last week, a Turtles van that I ordered and uh, a couple of weeks ago now actually. And it was really, really destroyed the box, so I, I sent that back for a refund. So, just looking at this one now. Try and do it around the camera. So the First one is the Freddy, Floaty Freddy. There we go. I can't remember the names and they've released that many of them. Really like this one because it's got the Loch Ness Monster um, Floaty Freddy there. Again, the box looks fairly decent on that one. So that's always a, a bonus. So the next one is the Freddy Fun on the Run. Really nice one where he's holding the probably just see there just holding little fun on the run there he's got his hat on you can just sort of see that in the reflection there again the box looks fairly decent on this one so i've been lucky so far i always find with funko they get really lucky or really unlucky with their boxes and this one here is the tony the tiger now we did actually get two of these just because i really like the character and i was a bit worried if i did get a damaged box that and I do at some point would like to get the uh, bit of work on there. But that's worked off. That's I think honestly I think that's one of the best ones. You probably can't quite see, but there's a surfboard in there as well, just at the bottom there. But yeah, there's a Flocks two thousand piece one from the convention as well that I would like to get my hands on at some point. Doing any of these conventions, we never really get the uh, the good deals. I would say they always tend to be there. Oh, there we go. So the bitty pots are just in some. The other issue with Funko, they just wrap things in paper, which is always risky. But um, yeah, I mean, I take these out of the box anyway, so I'm not even bothered what condition the box is in for these. Um, this one, you've got the Freddy there with the bag, like the convention one. There's the Mare one, the superhero, and the end one is just very similar, actually, to the Full on the Run Freddy there, just a bitty pop version. I am quite quite enjoying collecting these at the moment so yeah they're uh, about 13 pounds i think they were so that's that one there are a couple of other pops i didn't order yet as well so like the do i really like rita repulsa from power rangers and a few others as well that i would like to get at some point but the, i just went for the ones that i really wanted to get initially Oh, got some good ones in here. So we've got another, we've got a Freddy there as Toucan, which is really nice. The box looks fairly good on that. It's a little bit of a, well, it's just a bit of hair from the corner there, actually. But that one, I only ordered, there was a slight tear in that corner there, but nothing major. That's a really nice one, the convention Freddy. I think that one sold out, actually. It's one of the few that did. Tony the Tiger. That does have a little bit of a damage on the top there, hence why I'm glad he ordered two of that one. But um, I think it's just where the card is slightly folded, to be honest, it's not the worst bit I've seen. But yeah, Funko boxes, as we know, they're not the best. So that's that one. And this one is the Proto, the dog. Again, another one that I really wanted. The box looks really nice on that one. And you just see there, he's holding the Blockbuster Rewind box ticket whatever you want to call it but yeah i really like that one i've got the soda coming of that as well so it's really well done the proto character 
Um, and then I've got one more, I think. I'm just pleased that at least had the sense to put them in like sorters. Like I said, the last few I've had have been in, uh, in paper. Oh yeah. Just trying to remember which ones I actually ordered. I did, I did do quite a big order at once, so. Um, this one is the Bowling Freddy, which actually in person looks a lot better than it does on the glam shots. Yep, so that's uh, just thought it was an unusual one, that, so it's not one you see very often. A lot of these haven't sold out, actually. I think the main ones are Tony the Tiger and uh, the Freddy's 2 can. This one is the Scooby Doo, which I've got for my partner mainly. I'm a Scooby Doo fan myself, but yeah, mainly probably for her. Box looks pretty good. I think we'd be really lucky with these boxes, actually. But yeah, I really like that one where he's in the space. Um, sorry, the scuba outfit. I always think it looks like a space one, that. And the final one for this order. And again, I think we got lucky with the box is the Toucan Freddy, which we don't normally get in the UK or Europe. And I know they've done these every year, and I just thought this one was quite nice because he's flying, so. Yeah, so I'm really, really happy with those, actually. Didn't get anything where I thought, you know, it's gonna go back for a refund. And there's just another quick video of all the pops that we got today. Oh, there's a lot of good ones there, actually. It'd be hard to choose. Probably going to lean towards the uh, Tony the Tiger, though, because I do really like that. But a lot of the Freddies have been very good this year. And then there's the the Bitty Pops. So, yeah. Well, that's all for today's video. So thank you for tuning in. And hopefully I'll be back with some more of the Fun Days boxes when they arrive. Please leave a, a comment, thumbs up and subscribe to these videos if you would like me to do more there should be a little subscribe button in the bottom right corner of your screen if you press that that will subscribe to my channel thank you very much bye bye